we're back again today with our third business, third local business. Well, not really local. You guys are going to be in Coral Gables. In Doral. Doral. Actually, we're going to be in Doral. But yeah. that's local to South Florida. So uh, what we do here at VIP is we focus on uh, our businesses, our local businesses, and we get them out there so all you VIP people can come to their places and enjoy their services. Now, the name of the company is? Tripping Animals Brewery. Tripping Animals Brewery. That's a great name. Um, tell us a little about the business, where, where it is. Give me a little insight, your background. Well, the business basically is just a, a brewery. We focus on brewing beer, and we're going to be located in Doral. Right. We mostly are a, a brewery that are hop forwards. We truly love IPAs, pale ales, and Belgian beers. Right. Um, yeah, right now we're on the build out, try to open, working with the city and and the build out hasn't been so so pretty at all, but yeah, we are yeah, getting there. Hard, you know, hard it's hard, hard. Yeah. 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 But we're going to show some of the build out and some of the stuff uh, before they actually open, which is going to be very interesting. We're really looking forward to it. And I think uh, when we have our little event here, November 4th, you, you, 4th you're going to bring us a couple of samples, right? Totally, of yeah, of oh, course. That's going to be fun. Maybe a keg, not a sample. Uh-oh. <laughs> all oh, right. We're in trouble. So <laughs> we, can, we can get trippy here. <laughs> <too>. yeah, yeah. <laughs> and right here, you are the head of operations, right? Um, kind of, and also brewer, really. And brewer. So you're the, okay. So give us a little background on the brewing, the brewing end. So on the brewing end, you kind of just have your four basic ingredients, which is malts, you have hops, water, and yeast. And what, that's the only things you really need to make a beer. Right. These, these breweries now are so popular. You guys are coming in right when it's really hot. And the yeah. name, I love the name. I appreciate it. I love the logo. Yeah. You guys, well, you're going to see the logo. We're going to put it up when we do the edited version. But um, breweries are real popular now because all these different tastes, you know, it's, it's, it's really cool. Like, I like the uh, one root beer. It tastes just like r regular root beer. Yeah. That's a beer. Right, right. Yeah. You, get, yeah. you have a few of them, and you're like, wow, <laughs> this is not regular root beer. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But these guys are really cool, and we look forward to working with them. But give us, like, your website. Give us a little background on, on, on yeah. your location, as much as you can. <clears> get our us. website is pretty much trippinganimals.com, as well as our Facebook and our Instagram. So if people can follow us in there, they, they can see the process of the build-out and where we do, where are we going to be, the event that we're going to cover, where are we going to be pouring right. that beer for the people. We're looking around January, you said. We're the, looking right? around between January and March. For the, for the grand opening. For yeah. the grand opening, yeah. January, March. You just extended it two months. On What's the matter with yeah, you? Yeah, because, want, you know. We want, we want you open right away so we can get in there. Me too. You, what do you think? I've been <laughs> dreaming every day to open that brewery. <laughs> but we're going to, like I said, we're going to have some samples here the 4th. And uh, you guys are welcome to come down and taste it and, and get to meet these guys. These guys are really cool. And. We did a little talking in the back about a little secret project we're not going <laughs> to mention right now, but how do you, what do you guys think of that idea? That's awesome. Yeah. That sounds awesome. like a lot of fun. Yeah, sounds like a lot of fun. Yeah. I'm really, really looking forward to, to work with you guys as soon as possible right. and to see what we can do together and grow together. That's our goal. Yeah. Like, get connected with people it's and grow together, help the community. Right. It's all about um, networking. Yeah. And working together. Um, and the, the great thing about it is we all fall in the same genre. You know, our group of people loves what you do, your group of people loves what we do, exactly. and it kind of works together. And on our little networking event here, you're going to meet a lot of businesses in the area, and it's going to help in interact. And if you guys are interested, November 4th, we're going to have a, a, a business networking uh, event here, and we're going to be able to film you like this. But like I said, every Wednesday and Thursday, we do this. We sit down with, the, with business owners and unique business owners, because not every business can be on VIP TV. <laughs> Sorry. It has to be something special and something unique. And we'll, we'll talk to you. We'll, we'll put a little video guys uh, together for you guys. And, and no obligation. That's why, if you're interested, inbox me, and let's get you up here. Let's get talking about you. And you gave, gave them the website. Give it to them one more time. Trippinganimals.com. Trippinganimals.com. Yeah. Now, it's going to be a brewery and a restaurant. Well, tell us a little about the menu. Yeah, it's going to be a small kitchen. We're still working on the menu. We're probably going to focus on, on sandwiches yeah. and, and charcuterie, maybe like a really nice ham, 
cheese, salami, stuff that goes yeah. well with the stuff that goes well. Yeah, small tapas, yeah. menu. The, the main product she is the liquid stuff. That, yeah. Yeah. yeah, exactly. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, people gotta eat too, you know. Yeah, yeah, especially when, you when you're drinking beer, exactly. exactly. it's always good to have a, like a nice glass of water as well on the side yeah. <laughs> and a really nice meal. <laughs> but when you, when you start pounding some brews, you definitely want to start eating some. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. You know, you know? That's, that's a good idea. To have a limited menu, but good stuff. I heard one day that the more you eat, the more you drink too. So. Oh, so you got up the menu, my exactly, brother. Exactly, yeah. But anything else you guys want to add? Did I leave anything out? Well, you tell me. Your background. Give me a little bit on your background. Well, I'm from Venezuela, a place in South America that is called Acarigua, a small town. I grew, I, I, I was born and raised over there, and then I moved to England as a study abroad to learn English, and then right. I went to to St. Louis, Missouri, and to Lindenwood where, University. That's where you met our boy, Jerry. Exactly, yeah. that's where we met, yeah, we're lions. <laughs> yeah. And then over there, I had the nice opportunity to work with a nice brewery that is called O'Fallon Brewery. I worked for them for like two years. Right. And I learned a lot, and then my partners, Juan Manuel Torres and Daniel Chocron, they own a nano brewery in Venezuela that is called Cervecería Coronaria, and and because of the situation right now, all this crisis that is happening in my country, they gotta evacuate and move here and try to to keep with that dream that is right. to brew beer for the people. Awesome. And what about you, sir? Me, I'm just kind of been brewing for around seven years. Wow. So just mainly home brewing, videos online, kind of updates on how to brew one for, for some people online so also. So you were underage when you were brewing a beer. <laughs> <laughs> so you, you had videos online of you brewing? So I had some, yeah. Could you tell us where we could find them? I mean, you can find them on YouTube, usually, mm -hmm. but... So is it true what they say? There's a lot more behind the scenes with the brewing stuff that oh, yeah. we know about. A lot goes oh, yeah. into it, right? A lot of time. A lot right. of time. A lot a of tasting lot of and stuff. So that's the fun part, right? Yeah, so, yeah it is. Unless <laughs> yeah. unless the beer comes out bad, and then you're like, wow, wow, there goes three weeks of our lives off of a beer that's not good. Yeah. So we how, do it. <laughs> so how many flavors do you think you guys are going to have there? Ballpark. Well, right now we have like 14 recipes where yeah. we are going to focus on being releasing beers every week, okay. pretty much. We're gonna have like our core beers, but then our main idea is to release beer anytime every. we can. And also, we wanna do a lot of collab with, with other breweries. That that, like that, that's a good point, yeah. yeah. They wanna work and collaborate with other breweries and come up with other flavors and, you, and bring their flavors to their place and vice versa, right? Exactly. exactly. Which, what is the, what do you think is your most favorite one, the most popular gonna be? What do you think? I don't know. I like all of them, to be honest. Yeah, I, enjoy, problem, I enjoy. I enjoy all of them. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah, we gotta see what the market has for us. You know, you can have root beer for me, right? Yeah, yeah always. Yeah, yeah, of course. If you, yeah, anything you would like. All right, guys, it's been a pleasure. A uh, pleasure and, is mine. Yeah. Lo look for these guys. Look for them here. We're gonna have them come in here a couple more times because they're fun to hang out with too. And November fourth, come here and check them out. <laughs> Thank you, guys. You guys keep on tripping, right? Yeah. <laughs> right on. <laughs> VIP TV. Yeah. Nah.